anytime you like. Hi guys and welcome to day six of Mad March. I'm here with Claire. Hi. She is an old high school friend of mine. Let's get started. We're making chocolate lava cakes today. That should be fun. We've never made them before. Sorry. So, um, fingers crossed. <laughs> we need one and a half tablespoons of butter. Butter. <laughs> 80 grams of chocolate. We have Nestle chocolate. We need two tablespoons of sugar. It's a lot of, it looks like a lot of sugar, but that's it in here. <laughs> One egg in our beautiful we need the food cup. Egg cup. <laughs> Priorities. A tablespoon of vanilla extract. We have imitation vanilla because it's cheaper. Broke life. <laughs> it still works the same though. Um, two tablespoons of flour. And you also need um, some form of little dish that you can cook it in. I think they're actually called ramekins, if I remember correctly. They're cute, it works. Yeah. <laughs> and we have plates, because you don't eat them in the ramekins, they look better on plates. For display purposes, and for the Instagram shots. Unless you don't do the goo properly, and it's a good way to hide the goo. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Equipment, you will need a saucepan, a wooden spoon, and I think it's called a spatula. spatula. And a spatula. We're also going to need an oven and a stove top, which helps as well. That might have been obvious. Preheat the oven to 220 degrees Celsius. So we need to put butter into our saucepan. The butter is at room temperature, which I hope is okay. Chocolate next. I think we have to mix it now, guys. It's going well. <laughs> Give it some time, it'll get there. Mm. Chocolate. Alright, next step is two tablespoons of sugar. It's not the worst cake I've made. I'll tell you that. Which you should is... have seen some of the ones you made when we were younger. <laughs> yeah, Bianca, <laughs> Bianca and I got up at 12 a.m. one time to make a cake, and like, it was so bad. My dad eats anything. My dad refused to eat it. We put it out in the mulch. Three weeks later, it was still there. Like, not even the worms would eat it. <laughs> That's how bad some of my cream has been. So really, we were just set up for disaster. Yeah, <laughs> what it looks like right now, this is not how it's meant to look. Yay, Miss me. Yay. <laughs> Cracker, I'm a terrible person to crack eggs. We added the egg and the flour, and it looks better. I'm not gonna lie. We think we can recover. And we're now gonna add one tablespoon of vanilla extract, or imitation vanilla, because it's cheaper. Fixed it. It might be a little lumpy, but you know. It, it's good. It's always good to chew through. Once your mixture is mixed and nice and goopy, pour it half into one ramekin and half into the other. But that step is done. We're going to put them on the oven tray. Put them in the oven for 8 to 10 minutes. And say a little prayer to the cooking gods. <laughs> this is the part of the cooking where you can kind of clean um, or you can do a dance transition. What? Oh, I'm gonna do a dance transition. <laughs> the big reveal. Just put them on. Yeah. It actually looks kind of nice. Yes. Oh we have a cake thing, sort of. Kind of. It's a bit flat. Do you want to give it a go? Okay. Spoon? Spoon. Wait, did you want icing sugar? You know what? I think I want to taste it okay. first. Okay, alright. There's no lava coming out of it. It's kind of gooey. <gasps> lava! We have lava! It's beautiful. Yay! It's alright. It's not as chocolatey as it could be. Alright guys, that was interesting. It was an adventure. We got there in the end. <laughs> um, I'll put all the information in the description below. If you guys do a better job than Claire and I, please let me know in the description in the comments. Sorry, because I would love to know. And if you see what we did wrong, please let us know because I'm still wondering why it was all light minced meaty at the beginning. <laughs> Obviously um, not chefs. Do you have any social media you would like people to follow you on? Oh, I've got Instagram if people want to check that out. Yeah, I'll put Claire's Instagram in the description below as well. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. Yeah. And I will see you tomorrow for another day of Mad March. I hope you have a great day. Bye. Bye.